Hello everyone, my name is Neil Zorro and this is Updated Stats, your weekly gaming news show focusing on role-playing games. Here are the news for this week. Stoic, the company who brought us the banner saga, is under a legal dispute regarding the game's name. Company King, mostly famous for games such as Candy Crush Saga, filed a notice of opposition to prevent Stoic to trademark the banner saga by giving the reason that using the word saga will confuse potential customers. After a public outburst regarding this, King emitted a public statement saying, and I quote, King has not and is not trying to stop Banner Saga from using its name. We do not have any concerns that Banner Saga is trying to build on our brand or our content. But the notice of opposition remains the same and stipulates that Stoic's The Banner Saga mark is confusingly and deceptively similar to King's previously used Saga marks. Contacted by gaming news website Rock Paper Shotgun, Kings responded that they have no new comments to say on the matter. Now, being a small indie company, it would be unwise for Stoic to take legal actions against King, as they will be dragging costly legal disputes over a long period of time that will make them bankrupt. As of now, Stoic can't own the trademark for the banner saga, which is ironic considering that saga means a Viking epic. You can let King know how you feel about this situation by using the link in the description box below. Out for its first version this week is a mod called Voltec Multiplayer Mod, which enables you to play Fallout 3 in co-op. It still lacks important elements such as the server-side damage calculation or hit detection, which will come out in a future release. Link in the description box below. Quite a few new titles available this week. Might and Magic 10 Legacy is out for €22.99. The new installment in the famous Might and Magic series will have you play a party of four adventurers entangled in intrigue and political machinations. The old school single player and co op RPG Divinity Original Sin has its early access available on Steam for €39.99. Paper Sorcerer, a stylish single-player turn-based RPG focused on strategy, party building and environmental puzzle, has been released for the small price of €4.99. Euros. And finally, the iPad version for Baldur's Gate 2 Enhanced Edition is out for €40.99. That is all for this week, thank you for watching and see you later!